hello and welcome back to my channel if it's your first time on this channel you are welcome i am Anne aim poaching i'm an author and i also do business now today's video is basically for that part of my channel where we talk about business and we're still in the congo series basically i'm going to be giving you 20 business and investment opportunities within the fashion sector of the democratic republic of congo but before we get into today's video, if you are among those who watch my videos but have not yet subscribed, please do click the subscribe button and the notification bell that allows you to know when I've uploaded a video on this channel. Now, subscription is completely free. It just means that when I get to a thousand subscribers, which we are on that journey right now, um, I can diversify the way I basically release content to you basically i'll have the opportunity to not just create um you know pre-recorded content such as these ones but i'll also be able to create content and do premiere videos where i'll share the publish the video and come and interact with you based on that video directly in real time and also be able to live stream content to you in real time using various video equipment okay not just limited to my laptop or my desktop which i'm currently limited because i only have a small amount of subscribers at the moment that is why i need your help to get me to a thousand subscribers yes a thousand subscribers for those of you who are my new subscribers welcome to the channel and for those of you who are my old subscribers thank you so much for subscribing and continuously watching my content and also interacting in the comment section if my video whenever you watch my video and you have found it beneficial do give it a thumbs up because that lets me know that you like those kind of videos as well as let YouTube know that you, there's an audience on YouTube that likes that video kind of videos and they'll recommend YouTube will personally recommend it to other viewers okay who like such content as well now without further ado let us get into today's video number one is shoe selling business shoe selling business basically you can buy shoes on wholesale and then sell it to customers okay sell it to customers if you can't get it on wholesale you can get it from other stores and sell it on okay maybe when they're having sales you go and you buy a number as as small as 10 as large as 100 and then you sell it different types of shoes and you sell it okay um and make your money that way number two clothes selling business again just like shoes you can get on wholesale websites or even markets or you can go into during sales buy them at a lower price at your um a small amount to make your profit on top and you sell it to your customers that way okay you can now do that from the comfort of your own home where people can collect the clothes or you can sell it in an actual you know clothing store or shoe store selling store you can sell it in the actual market or you can sell it online using your online social media platforms or website okay um number three is a boutique business a boutique business that's where you sell both shoes you know shoes clothes accessories yeah and um, you can source all of these stuff on wholesale basis or just in the local stores where you buy buy them from other shops and then you sell it on in your own shop okay um number four is a clothing line business that is where you basically produce your own clothes your own clothing label and you sell it to the market 
UK to people online or in an actual store where you have an actual shop where you sell your products in, your clothes in, or even the local market where you can sell your clothes in as well. Okay. Um, number five, underwear manufacturing company. That is basically where you have a factory that creates underwear and it can be for both men, women or even children's underwear and then you supply the clothes shops and the, what's it called, the supermarkets that sell underwears and, underwears, and also maybe to people who sell you know underwears in the actual market space okay um number six is jewelry business jewelry business like earrings okay rings um necklaces uh what's it called what's the other one bangles okay so you can sell those things yeah so you, again you can get these in wholesale if you want to know a few wholesale companies let me know in the comment section and i'll give you a few in the comment section especially the ones that i use okay um so you can do that number seven is a bridal shop basically that is big that is having a wedding shop okay a shop that caters for wedding um you know where you sell wedding dresses okay and bridesmaids dresses and wedding shoes wedding you know accessories and handbags for weddings and those kind of stuff that women the woman okay who's getting married would want to buy everything that she would want to buy and you can have this either in actual on actual store and also still have an online presence basically you have an actual store where people can come into but also have an online space where you can advertise your products basically your bridal products online and have people order and you ship it to them okay number eight sunglasses production company that is basically when you have again a company that produces sunglasses okay so you can do sunglasses for men women children as well okay and you supply it to the opticians and to the local supermarkets as well that sell sunglasses especially during summertime and those um stores that also cater for travel for holidays basically they would want a travel section in their store so you can do that all year round okay um number nine is watch production company that is again a, a production a manufacturing company that you know um that creates watches so you can do watches for men women and children and supply to the watch stores and also to supermarkets that sell watches as well okay and then also an online store you can have an online presence where you advertise your business and have people order and you ship it to them okay number Number 10, handbag making business. That is where you have a business that is basically solely make, making um, handbags, okay, different types of handbags. And you can supply, you know, boutiques that sell handbags or supermarkets that sell handbags as well as other local stores that sell handbags as well as those people who sell in actual store markets. In the local markets within Congo okay and then you can also have an online presence where people can you make you make the um, you make the handbags and also have people actually 
buy place orders and buy directly from your online space okay that is using either your website or both your website and your social media platform number 11 fashion business fashion business that means you can combine everything to do with fashion from accessories to clothes to shoes okay for both men women as well as children you can combine or you can just focus on the men or you can just focus on the women or you can just focus on children or you can just focus on babies okay so regardless of what which one is your market you can um what's called um you can source those things um on a wholesale because it's always cheaper on a wholesale and then you sell it on to your customers whether it's online or in an uh, in-store where they can walk into the store and actually purchase the items okay number 12 tailoring tailoring business basically you make clothes okay it's a it's a business that allows you to make clothes okay so you can make clothes for men or women or um, children okay um and that again with that you can do it in the comfort of your own home or you can have a store that allows you to do that as well okay and then maybe hire a few people to help you in the production process um number 13 starting a fashion blog that is basically where you write articles to do with fashion you can write on accessories you can write on shoes you can write articles on dresses suits and menswear women's wear children's wear and then you put Google AdSense on there and people within the fashion industry can advertise their products on there and you they basically um, you get paid by the advertisers on your platform to advertise their products um, on your platform and then another way is that you can actually write a blog um, what's called do a fashion blogging business by actually being a freelance writer where you can write for blogs okay you can write for other bloggers yeah and actually get paid for that you know i got approached by a particular company who wanted me to blog to write blog articles for them and i said to them you know ask them how many blog articles would you like me to write and on what topic they gave me the topic they gave me the numbers however you have to make sure that these are people who will actually pay you up front um or put a deposit down up front and then the remainder when you deliver the article to them okay um this person wanted me to write but they were playing me as though i didn't know the value of article writing they wanted me to basically do all that work for free for them and i was just like no i ain't doing it okay so number um number 14 fashion designing that is basically where you write you um not write you draw you know you draw um fashion pieces and people can you know um People can buy your designs. You can buy your designs and create them, and you get paid for the, doing the designs, and that is it. Or you can design and then create the pieces and sell them on. Okay. Um, number fifteen, fashion magazine publication. Fashion magazine publication that is basically where you produce magazine to do with fashion okay that is where you know advertise clothes advertise shoes advertise accessories advertise fashion events you know like the fashion week 
and all of that um, you can advertise all of that as well and then you can advertise boutiques and all of that and have people advertise their boutiques in your magazine and you get paid for that your, you know their ads being in your magazine talking about magazines I do have a magazine called Tart magazine yes Tart magazine um, and it's an e-magazine that will be out shortly I did release it but then I deleted it when I was um, you know rebranding my website however they are going to be going to be released again very soon and it's basically a magazine that has you know a little bit of everything that I talk about um, from business to testimonies and to fashion and then real life issues you know as well in there so keep an eye out they'll be on my website so keep an eye out i always tag my website in the description box below so there are so many things in the description box below that you can um take advantage of Okay, so check out the description box below. Don't just watch the videos. Check the description as well. Um, number 16, e-commerce fashion store. That is basically an online store that is for fashion. Okay, so again, you can open an online store on your website. Um, you can create a website that has an online store. So then you can, you know, sell your fashion items on there okay i personally have an ebay store where i sell my fashion items there i sell men and women and children's accessories as well as clothes and other products okay um number 17 perfume business perfume business that is where you sell perfume you can have a store that allows you to sell perfume whether a in-person store where people walk in and buy that in person or online store where people can order perfumes and you ship it to them okay um or both and then Number 18 is a sportswear manufacturing company. Sportswear manufacturing company. That is basically when you have a manufacturing company that produces sportswear. So you can produce, you know, shirts and shorts and sweatshirts and jogging bottoms for sportswear. Okay, sportswear that can be basketball, that can be basketball, rugby, tennis, football all the different types of sports that need specific outfits for them okay and you can do it in different sizes you can do it for men women and also for children okay and then you can supply it to sports shop or sports companies as well your yeah, agencies that deal with sports um Number 19, online boutique. An online boutique, that's whether you open a website that has an online store where you sell different items, different fashion items, from shoes, bags, clothes, accessories, yeah? For men, women, children, or you can spe specifically go for the men and women or you can go for children to supply children's um, fashion items okay the last one is number 20 selling fashion accessories selling fashion accessories that can be um, earrings that can be rings that can be bangles that can be necklaces that can be scarves that can be hats okay So that is it. If you have any questions, 
to do with business in general not just the ones that I've shared on this video feel free to put it in the comment section again if it's too personal for the comment section feel free to send me a DM on my Facebook Instagram or Twitter and I'll respond to you there accordingly all my social media platforms are in the above section of my channel which is the about section you can just click on any of the links there and it will take you to the platform that you've clicked on and you can interact there specifically just for, you, just for business I don't use my social media platform predominantly for anything else okay um, that is it other than that have a good evening and i shall see you in the next video bye